Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord. Father God, we give you all the glory. Hallelujah. We give you all the praise and we give you all the honor, God. Hallelujah. Praise God. I will be speaking about two women in the Bible. All right. Eve and the woman with the issue of blood. All right. Hallelujah. Some things took place before Eve got here. I will be reading Genesis, the second chapter, verse 7, the King James. And the Lord God formed man of the dust of the ground and breathed into his nostrils the breath of life. And man became a living soul. How amazing. God took dust and made a human being. Amen. What an awesome God we serve. Amen. Able to make dust walk and talk. God gave dust a name, Adam. Hallelujah. Before I talk about Eve, I must speak about our Heavenly Father, God, who was the greatest surgeon. He was the first one to use anesthesia to put man in a deep sleep and perform a surgical procedure. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Now, I will be reading from Genesis 2nd chapter, 21st verse, Amplified. And the Lord God caused a deep sleep to fall upon Adam. And while he slept, he took one of his ribs, a uh, part of his side, which the rib was a cell, yes. and closed up the place with flesh. Yes. Genesis 2.22, Amplified. And the rib, a part of his side, which the Lord God had taken from the man, he built up and made into a woman. Amen. And he brought her to the man. Yes. Amen. Glory to God. The Bible says that God formed man, but he took the rib, which was a cell, that came out of Adam and built it up to make a woman. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 You see, God had to put some special things on the woman that he could put on a man. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. So he built us up. Hallelujah. Genesis 3.20. King James. And Adam called his wife's name Eve. Because she was the mother of all living. All right. Now. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Now, the woman with the issue of blood. Okay. Matthew 9.20. King James. And behold, a woman which was diseased with an issue of blood 12 years came behind him and touched the hem of his garment. Verse 21, she, what well, she said within herself, if I may but touch his garment, I shall be whole. Now I will paraphrase this. Amen. For 12 years, hallelujah, this woman went to many physicians yes. trying to get healed of her disease. She spent all of her living on physicians and she couldn't be healed of any. In fact, the Bible says that her condition got worse. Right, right. Glory to God. Then she heard about a man named Jesus. Jesus. <laughs> Who was going to different towns, healing the sick, yes. opening blind eyes. Raising the dead. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. When she heard Jesus was coming to her town, she began to say within herself, if she may touch the hem of his garment, she will be healed of her disease. Right. Hallelujah. When Jesus got to her town, he was surrounded by a large crowd of people because everywhere Jesus went, a large crowd of people, hallelujah, followed him. Amen. The woman with the issue began to put her works with her faith. Come on. Glory to God. Come on now. By pray, pressing her way through the crowd to get to Jesus. Yeah. The Bible says faith without works is yeah. dead. Yeah. When she got Come to on. Jesus, she touched the hem of his garment. And she was healed of her issue of blood. Yeah. Hallelujah. hallelujah. God the Father, hallelujah, took a rib, which was a cell out of Adam, and built it up to make a woman. Jesus the Son healed the woman. Yeah. God bless you, 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Be encouraged. Hallelujah.